do it fat. That's right, you heard me, do it fat. Hi, I'm Donna Duffy. I'm the CEO and founder of 3E Marketing Solutions, and I wanna welcome you to the Digital Demi Toss. This is your weekly shot of inspiration and wisdom to help you grow your business. So you heard me before, I said do it fat. Really? You're encouraging someone to do something fat? Yeah, I am. Just a few short months ago, I was preparing to do my TEDx talk right here in Wilmington. And that morning, as I was looking in the mirror and you know, getting myself together, I looked and I thought, oh, you know, you want it to be 15 pounds lighter. You wanted your hair to be different. You wanted this, you wanted that. And I thought, you know what, stop. And I looked in the mirror and I thought, this is an amazing moment. Drink it all in and just do it fat. And wow, that just perked me up. And it encouraged me to just go out there imperfectly and just give my best to those who are waiting to hear what I had to share. So as I thought about it later, I thought, well, what does that actually mean for me? And this is what do it fat has come to mean. So first means do it flawed, do it imperfectly. Show up, whether that's 15 pounds up, you didn't get your roots done, didn't get your nails done, you, you were off script a little bit, it's okay. There are bumps in the road, there are typos in the world, there are things that happen that aren't perfect. In fact, most of life is not perfect. So when we show up flawed, we give other people permission to be that way too. And we all breathe a little easier and we come and we bring our real selves to the table. So do it flawed. Next is to do it afraid. Now on that morning, giving that TEDx talk, you can ask all my friends, I was knocking, my knees were knocking, I was shaking in my boots and I was gonna go do it anyway. You could hear it in my voice. As I re-listened to my talk, I could hear it in my voice. I was afraid. It was a big moment for me, but I did it anyway. Is your fear holding you back? I hope not, because it's the fear and going past the fear that makes us step out into brand new vistas in ourselves. So I really hope that you're doing it afraid. Now, all of that would make us just abandon the whole thing and bounce and run away from it if not for the last thing, which means it's tied to your why. When things are tied to your why, no matter how big and scary it is, no matter how flawed you are, you're gonna show up. You're gonna bring your A game best as you can because there is a visceral, central, anchoring, centering why that says, do this thing. It's what you're called to do. It's what the world is waiting on for you to bring it. And so you're gonna step forward anyway. So the next time you hesitate a little bit because all your ducks aren't lined up or things aren't as perfect, uh, perfectly as done as you'd like them to be, just like I did right now, do it anyway. Do it fat, do it flawed, do it afraid, and do it tied to your why. I want you to tell me how you're doing it fat. Leave me a comment below and let me hear how courageous you're being in the moments when you would have run, but you did it anyway. I can't wait to hear how you're doing it fat. And I look forward to seeing you right back here next time on the Digital Demitas.